Hello everyone and welcome to exam B. So in this video, we are going to talk about the IT officer notification for IBPS RRB. And uh, I'm going to give you a detailed overview that uh, what all this exam is uh, going to offer for the IT aspirants out there. Uh, there are many jobs in government sectors and this particular job, which is IBPS RRB, IT officer for scale two is very popular among the IT aspirants. So one must know about this particular exam. So for this particular video, we are going to stick to the detailed overview and also what iExam B has to offer for your preparation and everything that you want to know about the exam. Apart from that, if you have any kind of query, you can mention that in the comment section. And also we will be providing one Google form there in the description. So if you have any query and you want any specific kind of session with us, we will just be very happy to help you out there. So what you need to do, you need to fill out that particular Google form that is there in the description box and uh, just you can reach out us in case of any queries. So let's start with our video. So first of all, you should know about the timeline that IVPS RRB scale 2 exam 2022 has to offer. Okay, so you can see that every tentative dates are there. There is no specific date, but yes, we have specific months in our list. So still we are not having the notification, right? We are not having the notification, but the exam will be conducted in single level in September 24. Okay, so we have one date. So doesn't matter when the application is going to come out, when we are going to fill our exam uh, form, the thing that we have in hand is the September 24, 2022. That is the day when IBPS RRB is going to conduct the exam for scale to officers. And this is a single level examination. So you just need to appear in one examination. And after that, you will be having your interview rounds. And once you clear both of these, you will be selected as an IBPS RRB officer in scale two. Okay. So uh, no, um, like uh, we don't have any information when the examination forms are going to out. But yes, we have a concrete thing that it is going to be 24th of September that uh, IBPS RRB is going to conduct the exam. So better we get our preparation started for the September. After that thing, you should know about the pattern of the exam, that how the exam is going to be conducted. So these are the sections that will be there in your exam and how many number of questions will be there in front of it, how many marks they will be offering as an entire section and overall duration of the exam is 2 hours and 30 minutes. It means overall duration is 2 hours and 30 minutes and there is no sectional timings. So even if you complete one section beforehand, you can go to other section right there only there is no sectional timing but yes there is a negative marking of one by four that you will be getting if you have an incorrect answer there is no negative marking for an unattempted question but if you attempt a question and the answer is going to turn out wrong you will be awarded by one fourth of negative of that particular question so you can see we have reasoning cons finance and you have language uh, paper then you have computer and then you have the professional knowledge so for IT aspirants, this professional knowledge will be offering the IT questions only and the rest of the things uh, I think are very well explained. They don't need any explanation that what all section that will be having. So overall, we will be having 240 questions and they will be giving you 200 total marks. Overall duration, 2 hours and 30 minutes. Ample amount of time to attempt these particular questions. Single level examination are very head through to the interviews you do not have to face two level of the examination so it is a very promising examination which a candidate must go if they are going to go for it exam and it officer level kind of preparation so this is a must go exam very short to noticed and like there will be only one level so it will be very uh, short for the entire examination process so you will get a quick results there now after that thing uh, what iExam B has to offer for this IBPS RRB scale to IT officer. So everything uh, that is there in cons, reasoning, English, and then uh, Hindi papers, and then finance, they are already there in our course. I'm going to give you a brief overview of this IT content that we are offering. So as you can see, we have just broke down all the components of the syllabus. Actually, they, there is no concrete syllabus given by our 
IBPS or RB, they never give a concrete syllabus. They just mention professional knowledge. So now from our understanding from the previous year patterns and the promising chapters that can come in your examination, we have just prepared some module inside the IT professional knowledge. And these are the list that you will be getting as in chapter for the entire exam. So there we have the basics, then operating system, networking, data structures, DBMS, Microsoft Office, SQLs, you can see OOPS concept, ELGO, then networking, then there are so many things that you will get. Okay, so these particular modules will uh, come here and there in your exam. And apart from that, what else you will be getting is all these four things. Okay, so you will be getting the introduction and how to prepare for the strategy, like how your strategy must be there for the exams. Then you will be having your phase one. There is only one phase, so that's why we have written it as phase one. Then we have your interview. So once you clarify for the interview and you get it uh, done, there is an interview thing that we have to offer. Then we have live classes. So we have live classes where we come online and there is a one-to-one -one session with you. You will get to know your uh, peers. You will get to know with the direct faculty what all your doubts are there. You will get them addressed. You will get a better uh, reach to the faculties and to your competitors who are preparing along with you. And if you fail to join any of the live class, there will be live classes recording that will be available to you. And uh, you can watch them if you have missed any of the class. So that is the section for the live class recordings. After that, we have the full length practice mock test. So you will be getting the full length practice mock test to make your preparation a final touch. So to, in order to prepare the main thing that account for success of any candidate is the examination mock test uh, thing. Okay, so even if you prepare a lot, but you do not give any mock test, it is very hard to predict that you will get a successful attempt in your exam so to prepare mock are very important and uh, we have very good understanding of the examination pattern and everything so we come up with a very good uh, productive and qualitative mock test so this is our course overview that we have to offer you and uh, definitely you can go and check our uh, website check our demo course there and uh, you can get an idea how the things are going to work at our end Okay, now the thing is like why this video is coming at this point of time when it is just the end of May. So you have to make an early start because an early start is a smarter way to proceed to the competition, right? Because you are having September in your hand, then you have June, July, August and September, let's say end. So you have entirely four months and for the working professional, if I have to say, Four months are actually not four months. They are actually the two months overall. Uh, sometimes you will not feel like studying. Sometimes your work pressure will be very high. So if any working professional is going to be there, they have to start now. It is not early for them. It is just the right time to start for your September exam. So any working professional, I will say that you have to start now in order to gain the success. For all the non-working professional, I will say utilize that time to make a head ahead uh instead of every particular competitor that is out there so if you start early you will be uh having more chances to get through the exam because you will be having more time invested during the preparation you will get more exposure and your concepts will be very much clear if you do a regular study for this particular four months so an early start is a smart start rest is on you guys how you are going to prepare uh, but according to me you should start now that's why this video is coming out there no matter whether the notification is out we have not to prepare when the notifications are coming out we have to prepare from that particular moment when our uh, dates are out and we want to prepare for that examination okay so we have that thing after that thing, we have our 50% faster preparation month, that is month of May. So this particular month, and you are going to get a mega offer of up to 70% off on all of the online courses. It is up to 70%. You can check on our website that what kind of uh, exam you are interested into and what offerings we are going to make there. But definitely this month is for the 50% faster preparation. And please hurry up, go and check a look to all the courses that you are interested into and make sure you make a good deal out of your uh, uh, career and preparation.
so that was all from my side if you still have any doubts uh, you can mention that in comment section also fill the google form if you want to fill any particular session requirement so i think that was all from our end and we'll bring so many more videos in coming uh, time so that you can get a better understanding for your particular it subjects and the examination for that time keep practicing and stay updated